Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Daniela and today we'll continue with the voice. This time episode 5 of the first season. In the last episode we got the new face, the female. Uh, she's another soup and she was kept in a basement by one. Actually, Frenchy Butcher and the other two were the ones that found her and, you know, let her go and captured her at the end. Um, also, Huey went on a date with Annie. Uh, he tapped her phone. So that's a thing. Oh, and also the dip. Uh, save the dolphin. I mean, it died at the end, but um, you no, know, at least doesn't live in an aquarium anymore. So should be counted as a save. Anyway, as usual, I got something to drink. The episode is ready to start. So without further ado, let's do this. I think I have some some good news. Do you now? Good news. Still well. She's open to us going public. Let's to go public. You have to confirm with me. Like I have to know who you told about compound B. Don't. Don't say a word. You're gonna die. I told these guys you were running B down near the noodle palace. And you're dead. Overdose. Well, heroin overdose. He made him do it. <sighs> I'm sorry to hear that. Mm, I bet you are. Come on. I love you. Your family. Mm -hmm. I'll always be watching over you. And that's the scary part. <laughs> Can you speak? So we can find these fuckers who did this to you. So I can get you back home. Believe Expo. Of course, she has wings. So Jesus, Jesus said, hey, bro. <laughs> hey, bro, bring it in. <laughs> <laughs> this is from that club you took me to? You remembered our first night together. I'm touched. Okay, why is this the first time I'm hearing about this plane? This kid needs to be trained up, Butcher. Yeah. Yeah, what do you say? Nah, I, I don't know how to blackmail anybody. Huey, yeah, we've done a murder. Comparatively speaking, this will be a piece of cake. <laughs> Look, babe, nobody wanted that airplane to go down the way it did. Of course not. We gotta make the best of it. Otherwise, well, otherwise it was all for nothing. This bitch. Flying straight. When did that happen? What are you talking about? It's always been there. And it's Homelander with an airplane. That airplane did a fly. Too straight. You know, I think, I think everyone hopes that their first is the one. Um, it's private, but... Uh, virgin. If there is some geezer out there with a big white beard, he's a world heavyweight cunt. I, I'm sorry, did you just call God a C word? Yeah, he's got a hard on for mass murder and giving kids cancer. And this big old answer to the existential clusterfuck that is humanity is to nail his own bleeding son to a plate. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's Morgan Freeman up there or anything, but it can't all be random chaos. Again, the fly. So you think that what happened to Robin is some kind of divine intervention? Is that oh, what you're saying? Richard. Every time he's trying to get closer to her, Robin just pops out. Is there any way you could hook me up with one of those diamond club passes? You know, to, to see Ezekiel. Yeah, yeah. Sure, of course. It's the least I could do. Mm, I feel sorry for her. She seemed disappointed. Hey, pal, how are you? 
you're gonna rip a arm while high-fiving someone. What is the emergency? My speech. Your speech? Yes, my speech. It reads like corporate fucking mayonnaise. We're talking believe here. These are my people. Don't forget, it was me that saved that flight 37 See, that this... really turned that into a win. A thing to call really it. Talk to me about saving flight 37. Huh. We need boundaries. <laughs> One day, Homelander, the baby, I. Everyone is so happy to see him. <laughs> Frenchy mother's milk. Her, Susan. It's nothing, cause there's nothing fucking down there. And for all you know, Rebecca's still out there somewhere. You put up your fucking hands, don't. Stop. You need to stop. It has been eight years since she's been missing. The cops never found anything. You never found anything. She's not alive. Did they catch Butcher and French? All right. <gasps> God, there is oh fuck. They he took the phone out of his pocket. Yeah, sorry, just um I'm afraid of water. <laughs> what Go he back. meant to say, I'm afraid of you. <laughs> Do you accept the Lord and Father as your savior? Oh Jesus. As your son. <laughs> that grip on his neck, god damn it. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> like I stop smiling. You fucked me. What? <laughs> yeah, in a private soup club. You played my butt like jazz. <sighs> Wouldn't be funny if, like, he, everything he does, it's to avenge. Back, all right, because he thinks the soup. So Homelander had something to do with it, right? Wouldn't be funny if she just ran away with somebody or from Butcher. She looked sad in that video, and they didn't find the body. So, because I believe that what God wants me to do is get on over there. Find the filthy bastards that masterminded this, whatever cave there mm, is. Or stage. And then just do a little thing called God's judgment. The righteous shall rejoice when he sees the vengeance. And he will bathe his feet in the blood of the wicked. Is that a real thing from the Bible? Because that's metal as fuck. You've been drinking. No. You're not going to meetings anymore. Listen. <laughs> Water under the bridge. Go back to your ivory penthouse where you can drink and fuck whoever you want. Go back to Homelander. <sighs> Go back. I keep thinking about all, all those people. It's okay, you'll figure it out. Okay, you'll figure it out. You always know what to do. They're coming. They're on to you, babe. Black Noir was outside my She room. is so what location? beautiful. Damn. Which addresses do they have? If they got to my place, all of them. I've waited 22 years for this. This isn't it's not about you. What the fuck? This isn't about you. Oh my god, another. Hedgehog's mother. Are watch me on TV. So? Who's more important? Your friends or your daughter? Oh my god. They come in Finny and Cat. That's so cute. The soups. And this goes on my heart. I'm going to leave you here for them to find. Like a gun, he takes me, points me in a direction, and fires. It's not who I am. It's not who you are either. And we're the same, you and I. Like eggs, hard outside, soft inside, or pineapples, perhaps. <laughs> exactly like pineapples. Oh, stop. And she's gone. Honestly, it's 
It's just how goddamn certain <gasps> everyone She is. said goddamn. What's immoral is the guy who shoved his dick in my face. <laughs> shit. I'm done pretending. And I'm done taking any more shit. Are those incubators? They are giving V to babies. That's how the soups are made. Jesus. That's a fucking baby soup. I'm so here for you. It's not like that. You sure? Because I can get you commemorative cup. Or I can get you an Ezekiel figurine or a goodie bag. My girlfriend died. What? If they don't use the baby with the laser eyes. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Is she gonna breastfeed him? You have to be good. And you have to listen to me. Oh, she's back. <laughs> oh. hmm. He's bleeding. Bitch. Oh my god. die like that she has uh, healing abilities <sighs> oh so happy yeah <laughs> she has healing powers she has healing powers oh mm. that's so cute <laughs> So that was a thing. Uh, Starlight might be into big troubles with uh, Vat. But we'll see. Um, as I expected, uh, A Train killed Popclaw. He seemed that he cared about her. He loved her. Um, like. He didn't seem to be 100% into killing her, but when Homelander tells you to do something, like, gotta do it. <laughs> Who wants to be on his bad side? But being in the seven is the most important thing for a train. So, Mib is not in a good place. Uh, really affected her what, uh, what happened on uh, the plane. Or what Homelander did, uh, she went back to her ex, left her for Homelander. But I think getting together with Homelander was like a publicity stunt for from uh, what they told her to leave Elena and get with Homelander at least for you know public eye. Um, and maybe that's why she start drinking in the first place. Also, in a way, I think it's better she didn't say anything to, to her ex about what Homelander did. I don't know if she could kept it a secret, not let the people know about what the soups are doing. And with Homelander, you know, having no problem with killing, uh, I think she would have been in great danger, so it's better if she doesn't know. I was happy to see Black Noir in action, but um, I hoped for something more, I mean to know more about him, uh, just that Penry is a great fighter and can jump from higher places and not get hurt, but 
also he's bleeding so that's a interesting fact i always wondered how uh, soups get their powers uh, i thought that they are actually born with uh, with them but apparently no they take normal babies and inject them with compound v i wonder if the mothers know or they don't tell anybody and you know wait to see what happens and also how they get their like specific powers is just random or they do they kind of modify the compound to give each of them a different power what if madeline's baby is a soup as well because like homelander is kind of getting out of control madeline seems to be able to control him for now like i wonder for how much longer she can do that you're a good boy you're my good boy you should be a good boy you're my special boy and the fingers down his throat gonna work at one point the mommy thing is not gonna work and that's gonna be bad for everyone i think this is all i have to say about this episode thank you for watching i hope you enjoy and i will see you next time bye